Today's segment is called Woof, Woof, Woof. <laughs> if you're looking for some fun in the sun with your dog, today we're going to see five great places to get outside with your dog around Fort Lauderdale. The first one is Canine Beach. Fort Lauderdale is not just a day at the beach for us humans. There is a dedicated canine beach immediately north of Sunrise Boulevard. It's a great place to let your dog frolic in the surf and run around in the sand with their friends. The beach is open to dogs with a $30 yearly permit on Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays between 3 and 7 p.m. and 3 and 9 p.m. between April and October. There are dog bags, water, and beach showers at this dog park. There is even a city officer on site to make certain that no problems happen and rule enforcement is enforced at the beach. The beach is close to the road, but the officer and the dunes are both between the beach and the road. So really, the only challenge is parking. Second place, Bark Park and Swim at Snyder Park. If you have a dog that loves to swim, you may want to check out the Bark Park and Swim at Snyder Park. This lush and shaded park has a filtered lagoon that is perfect for dogs that love the water. There is also a shaded fenced in area where dogs can run free. It's free to use, but there are parking fees on weekends. From March to October, it's open from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. And from November to February, it closes at 6 p.m. In Holiday Park, in the heart of Victoria Park is Holiday Park Dog Park. The park has a fenced in area so that dogs can run and play and catch. It's divided into two areas, one for the bigger dogs and one for the smaller dogs. There's plenty of seating and shade in each area, complete with water fountains for the dogs and for the people. There is plenty of free parking as well. Riverwalk Park in the heart of downtown is one of the most spectacular places to walk your four-legged friends. Riverwalk Park allows downtown dwellers the perfect stroll along the New River, past historic old buildings and dramatic old shade trees. There is a big lawn where you meet up with Esplanade Park, a great place to throw a ball or a frisbee. Finally, Colahatchee Park. It's an 8.5 acre community park, which includes seven acres of mangrove preserves. An elevated walkway takes you through the wetland areas to the middle river and leads to the back of the park where the dog play area is located. A dog park permit and key fob are required for entry into this dog park from the city of Wilt Manors. The park is open from 8 a.m. to dusk. 